Tonight, it's a driver's nightmare. You're speeding down I-5 right by the stadiums when a huge rock comes crashing through the windshield thrown from the I-90 overpass way above. Well, that's exactly what happened earlier today. Unfortunately, the victim survived, but tonight, law enforcement still searching for the person responsible. Q13's Jennifer Lee has a story. We were just in a daze at that moment. In a daze after a rock was smashed into their windshield, Shakir Watkins says his girlfriend was driving and he was in the passenger seat on Interstate 5 in Seattle. They were driving about the speed limit at 60 miles an hour. Out of nowhere, around the left-hand side barricade, a random person popped up over the barricade with a rock in their hand and just into the car. Take a look at how large that rock is. It ended up doing more than just damaging the car. It hit the windshield and then impacted me in the chest and in my chin. Just felt winded. Like if you've ever been in football or anything and you got hit uh, hit super hard and you just lose the breath out of you, that's exactly how it felt on purpose. Washington State Patrol is investigating and looking for a suspect. Troopers say someone could have gotten seriously hurt. They've also seen this type of crime before near the same exact spot. Back in October, State Patrol tweeted these pictures of damaged vehicles on I-5 near 90. Watkins says be wary and stay home as much as you can. This year is wild. Everybody sees that. People are going crazy. And that was Jennifer Lee reporting. Well, it was hard to see on the...